Hello, today I'm going to show you real quick how to activate a King Gamer key on your Ubisoft Connect right here. For those of you that are a little confused, Ubisoft Connect is a new version of Uplay, you may say. You can't really use Uplay anymore, you can't even download it, so it's essentially dead. Uh, this is the, what the login screen looks like for Ubisoft Connect. And first, you need to actually download the app. For that, you go to your browser and you can search for download Ubisoft Connect, download Uplay, and you'll see this first option right here where it says UbisoftConnect.com, or you may even just go to the website directly, which will bring you here. And you click on the download for PC button, which I'm not gonna do right now because I already do have it. Once you download it, then you'll be able to install it and run it. And this is what it looks like again when you have it. And if you don't have an account, you can cl click on the create new account link. It would ask you to create a username, ask you for your email, a password, date of birth, and to accept Ubisoft terms of use, terms of sale and privacy policy, all those uh, regular stuff. And when you do have an account, or if you already have one account from Uplay, it will carry over here. And you can either try to recover your password, or if you do remember it, then you can simply enter it. And you shouldn't have a lot of trouble logging in to the actual app. And it will bring you to the main page. What you're looking for here is to go right here to the upper left corner on this menu button. When you press it, you get the first option that's, that says activate a key. By clicking on it, you get a pop-up where you would enter the key that you can find on your King Gamer account that you already bought at this point. And you can start entering the actual key. Um, do keep in mind that, as you can see here, the Ubisoft activation codes all have dashes, even if the forms or the format changes a little bit, they all have dashes and you can enter digits here without the dashes being added automatically. So you have to do that by yourself, entering whatever number of characters, and then the dash, not characters and dash. And then you can click on activate, and in this case it's gonna give me an error because it's just gibberish. And at this point, if you're getting this error message about the activation code not being valid, I recommend first going back to your key on, on your account and making sure you have it correctly. It's very easy to mistake a one for an L or an I, or a zero for an O, and in some cases it's very easy to miss entire sections of the actual code. Um, so go back to your account, make sure that, it, that it's being entered correctly. If you've already double checked and triple checked that it's being entered correctly, then, and you're still getting a message, of course, then you can uh, reach us on the link in the description below uh, for us to be able to help you out. Maybe there is something wrong with the key or there's something else we can do. And, if you are getting an error message constantly, even though you are positive about the key being correct, don't keep trying it because you might get locked out and that's just gonna take longer. Now, when you activate a key, it would show in your games tab. And for instance, if you want to, act to actually download a game, if you, the download didn't start automatically, then you can go to the, to the game that you just activated with the key and click on the download button. And you will get a download process and once it's downloaded this download button would change from download to play and that's how you know it's done and that's pretty much the gist of it i hope this was helpful and i'll see you next time